Hello, welcome to Border Bananas. I'm Jamie and here on this channel, I love thrifting, home decorating, on a budget, um, as well as organizing and all that kind of stuff. Um, I'm a firm believer in living on a budget, but I do think there are some things that are worth splurging on too. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I am so happy to have you today. We are going thrifting at Goodwill. I ran in quick this week um, on a Wednesday, so it was 25% off day for me. And um, everything that I bought, I will show you at the end of the fr thrifting footage. So let's go thrifting. Okay, right away, for some reason, I was had the inkling to go straight back to the furniture today. And this is probably why. This guy is so cool. He's only 25, no, he's $30, sorry. Um, and he's the perfect little coffee table. I would trim down the legs just a little bit, give him a nice fresh coat of paint, fix up this little chip here. But it is such a great little stand. It'd be perfect for like a TV room too, as is. Um, and it's only 30 bucks. Great little score, perfect for a little flip th thrift flip. And this little guy is so cool too. What is this, like a plant stand for 10 bucks? How cute is that? It's kind of tall too. They have some great stuff in store today. This guy is still here, can't believe it. <gasps> Look at that lamp. Oh, you guys, come on. It's a little bent, but I love it. Look at that. That's a great lamp. Okay, this is super cute too. For $6.99. That's adorable. Little hamper there. Let's see if I can get better. There we go. So I really like this frame. I'm not a fan of the art. I know other people are um fan of this style art, but I am not. But I do like the frame. That would be a nice car at $2.99. That's not bad either. And it looks like somebody had some uh, wedding frames here. I still love that frame. One of those old. I what is that look like from the seventies? Like the the Jesus print. Oh, it's a heart. Love grows happy hearts. Look at that. That thing, this is so on trend right now. Uh, let's see, where is the price? I have no idea. I don't see a price on it. Nope, but it's super on trend right now. I was thinking about getting one of these to make a pleated shade out of for like summertime, like a summer colored one. I have one that is plaid that is more fall colored. I actually own this printer and I love it. 10.99 is a score. <laughs> 3 dollars that's cute. Fire King. Oh wow, that is cool. What's this? $3.99 
it has been a while since I found some cobalt glass, but that's still at 49. I have a feeling that this is new. It's not very heavy and it does have the lid. So I bet this was an Amazon buy. Look at this cutie patootie. It's $1.99. It has a bright pink gasket. Such a cute little size though. I found some Dansk here. They're pretty. We've got some plates back there. These are all so beautiful. I love the pink florals. You know I think I have a thing for those fairy bowls. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look. <laughs> oh my goodness. Too bad it doesn't have the lid. I want to look at that platter back there though. Oh, isn't that sweet? All right, it's Easter basket season. What do we have here? Of course. That one's kind of neat. I like this. $4.99. Wow, look at this guy. It's only $15. She has been done so prettily. Aw. Then there's this back here. That's cute. Nursery planter. Okay, let's look at this guy. Oh. It's almost impossible to get this stuff out of here. It feels really weird. $2.99. Anything else in there? That's good. I don't see anything. Oh my goodness, look at these little guys. Takashi. It looks like there's two. Am I in your way? <laughs> Joie. I wonder what the recipe cards look like. Are they in there? Oh my gosh, I love this little cutie patootie. How cute is that? A dollar forty-nine. Oh my gosh. Well, this little guy's cute. Dollar ninety-nine. Will it hang on the wall? It doesn't have pre-made stuff, but it could totally be hung on the wall. There's some amber glass bottles. It looks like there may be three of them. So that's a good score. Um, I'm not going to bring these home though. And this is super cute as well. A dollar forty-nine. Wait, a dollar? No, four ninety-nine. <laughs> I knew I was saying something wrong there. <laughs> cute. This little guy has a chip here. That's super cute for $2.99. Look at that glass bag. That's so pretty. Love it. So this is piece is pretty cool. It's hand turned for $2.99. I suppose you could probably use it both ways. That's pretty cool. I love that. That's so pretty. For two ninety nine.
This guy is cool. He's $3.99, but that could be for just about anywhere, right? And a little mail sorter, too. I love that. Oh, here we go. This guy's giant. <laughs> $15. There's a copper music box. Church. Spotted some cast iron. Number seven, unmarked. It's a nice pan, though. So that's a rare find, a mallard decoy. That's kind of cool. Pick a purse. Should we dig for a second? I don't like digging too much in here, but. Sometimes you find some cute stuff, useful stuff. They just brought out this shelf. It's $15, it's beautiful. Look at the legs. However, if I were to get it, I would probably take the legs off. I'm actually looking for something for the top of a dresser. This would be the perfect size, but I think I could probably build it. Okay. I just found some bell pulls. Ooh, look at that one. That is cool. That is amazing. And there's this one. Wow. Let's see if I can find the price for you guys. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so this one is $6.99. And this one, oh, it's also $6.99 right there. There, I'll get you a better, a better view. I, oh, I love the color, so pretty. Wow. I'm not sure what brand these are, but I like those. $1.49. These are pretty too. Did I show these before? Have I seen those before? Those are really pretty. Field Market. Those are so pretty. Imagine for on a fall tablescape. Mm -hmm. Look like Corral, yeah. Oh my gosh, can you see that? That is so pretty. So I have been pushing this guy around in my cart for a little while, but I think this is going to go back on the shelf. It's $6.99. And I have, I, it's a monitor riser for my computer. Um, I do have one already and I have a feeling I won't like the way this sits, but I like the idea of being able to have a drawer underneath. But then again, I don't really need it. So it's going back on the shelf. I can't believe it. I found another blanket also just as pretty. And this is how I normally see them put together. The other one was put together way different. 
and it was super pretty. I like the way this is put together. I especially love the edge, but the other one, I liked the way this was done better. There is a Debbie Mum here. How much is it? $2.99. Isn't that cute? Whoops. And there's this guy. $4.99. And then over here, that's super cute too. For $4.99. That's just a print back there. You know, I always start these with, okay, so, and then I always edit it out because that's how I always start it. Let's get started. <laughs> it's so hard to not say that. I don't know why. I found just a few things today. My son is graduating soon. And um, I realized that I might need to get my daughter, my youngest, a dress. Uh, she, I think she has one. I got her a black dress for Halloween. She went as Ruby Gloom. Do you remember that? She was so into Ruby Gloom when she was little. Um, and, but I'm not sure it'll fit her still. So I don't know. I grabbed her another one and um, she is very, she loves goth and girly, girly goth, I guess is how I would put it. And so I wanted to make sure I got her something that I thought she might wear. She was not with me this time. So and this dress was from, is by Massimo, which is from Target and it was $4.99. I did get 25% off and it just looks like this. It's a cute little sleeveless dress with, it's very fitted. It has the pleats at the bottom. Does it have pockets? It does have, oh, that's cool. It does have pockets and a zipper up the back. So I thought that would be cute for her. I don't know if she likes it yet. She's actually sick. She's been sick all week. So just stuffy head, um, ear stuff, terrible headache. Oh, it's just all in her head. I feel bad for her. So um, I grabbed this for her. And that's the reason why she doesn't have it yet. Usually she confiscates everything before I can record it. So, and then I found a couple of small things. I First of all, I did pick up this. This was $2.99. So I think it like, works out to be like $2.25 or something. And I am going to pleat this. Um, for I have a candlestick lamp right over here in my craft room that has a brown plaid uh, pleated shade on it uh, and I love that shade but I kind of want to move or try to move that little candlestick lamp out into my kitchen maybe try it there um, and that brown won't go so I, I bought this one to see and it's just like the candlestick part on top there um, if I could pleat this into something that will match my kitchen. Um, I think I should be able to. I think it'll be cute. And hopefully that'll work out nicely. I have pleated a lampshade before and I do have a video on it. I will put that down in the description box for you. All right, next up was last week I bought a paper towel holder. It was like the cast iron. It was a blue cast iron one. It was missing the little spike that holds the paper around. Well, this week they had this one and unfortunately I don't have any idea where the tag went. I think, I think it was $2.99. It might've been $1.99, but it's just a simple black raw iron one. And I actually really like the simplicity of this one better. When you have the paper towels on it, it comes up to like right around here. So you only see this little top part. And I love this. I love how simple it is. I'm not going to spray paint it. I'm not going to do anything to it. I'm just going to re-donate the one I bought last week because I like this one better. This is kind of what I was looking for but not finding to begin with. So I'm excited about that. Very utilitarian. Next up, I found this little guy was $1.49. So I have, what is that? 25% off. 10% would be 15 cents, 30 cents. 37 cents off this, so a dollar something. <laughs> this little jar I thought was adorable. I love these little pot belly jars. It has like that fair isle print on it and like it's like a cranberry, like a mauvey cranberry, mulberry maybe. <laughs> but it is in such good condition. The gasket looks brand new. 
There's the price tag for you. I don't know what was in this to begin with. It does say something on the bottom. Can I read it from inside? No, I don't think so. Um, but I thought this would be cute at Christmas time to hold like sprinkles and a hot cocoa bar. Uh, it would be perfect for just any little type thing that you want to put in there. Um, maybe a little scoop or, for cinnamon or I don't know, something. Uh, but I thought it was super cute. And I couldn't leave this here. I have been collecting these little um, glass jars for my pantry. So that's what I'm going to do. The next thing I found was this uh, fitted, not fitted sheet, vintage sheet. It was $2.99, so it was $2.25, and it just looks like this. I pick these up every time I get a chance, if I find one in good quality, no matter the size, um, because they make... It's such beautiful fabric, first of all. I buy them for the fabric. Um, every once in a while, I'll save one and keep it as a sheet. But this one, I think, is going to be for the fabric. Because I think these will make such great pillow covers, table runners, tablecloths, curtains, napkins, whatever. It's just fabric in my book. And the quality of the fabric in the old vintage sheets does not... Com I mean, it's... Nothing compares to, I was going to say it does not compare. It does compare. You need to compare to these because <laughs> it's so good. They last, the, the more you wash them, the better they feel. I just, oh, I love them. So I picked this guy up and I am not a yellow girl, but I do love this buttery yellow, this nice and creamy. I think it is so pretty. The last item I found was a mug tree. It was $2.99. It was made by Alan Helmuth or Helmuth, not sure. Um, so I, I paid $2.25 for it after the discount. And it's just, I think it's beautiful. Uh, it is super sturdy. Nothing is loose or wiggly. Uh, it's just in great shape. I actually like the finish on it that it is, but I'm not sure I'm gonna change it. I don't know. I could paint it, I could strip it and do that like raw wood look. I think I do like that look as well, but I do like the finish it is now. It just needs a little bit of cleaning and maybe some wax. And that is what I got at the thrift store today. Um, not too much, just the right amount. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it when I find some good stuff that I can really use in my home, but it doesn't cost me an arm and leg because at one time, because <laughs> it just doesn't feel as bad, right? <laughs> I like to do things on a budget, so when I can keep it the budget lower, it, it just spreads out a little bit longer, right? Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. I know that our moments are not promised, so you choosing to spend a few of your moments here on Earth watching my little channel. I appreciate it so much. Thank you. And if you liked this video, I bet you like this one right here and you can subscribe right here. Thanks guys. Bye.